Howdy, 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 y'all. Welcome back and welcome to For Destiny, where if you want to know if the game's where your money belongs, come check it out with Army Mom Strong. Checking out Baron Breakfast today over on the Steam Next Fest for one of the free demos. It looks really interesting, and I liked the graphic style. I liked, like, the whole thing. It was something different and unique. Bear and Breakfast is a laid-back management adventure game where you build and run a bed and breakfast, but you're a bear. Now, I did record 18 minutes of this earlier. I was almost at the end of the episode, but I did the tutorial in the wrong order, and I couldn't get the thing to go to the next one. We've got to join their Discord. Uh, but I don't want to do that while I'm recording. So, let's just go down here to the new save, and let's start again. I mean, it was a lot of fun. I'll definitely be doing more than one episode on this. There's a couple demos that I'm only doing one episode on, because I just didn't... I'm not vibing it enough to do find more. Farther than they've ever gone before. Past the soothing meadows and the quiet streams, even past that one weird rock with all the moss. The new world they found was strange and terrifying, filled with uh, soothing meadows and quiet streams. It was pretty cool. Just like them. Annie, the Carillion Hound, brave but careful. Will, the poor Will, apathetic on the outside, yet surprisingly, even more so on the inside. And Hank, the brown bear, just as cheerful and curious now as he was two shrubs ago, but maybe a little anxious due to the promise he had made back home. No, Mom, I'm not gonna narrate everything out loud all day. Also, definitely not going to wander too far in an adventurous fashion. I promise. This is adorable. Suddenly, they catch a glimpse of something that they'd rarely seen back home. A sliver of white smoke. Not the kind that occasionally wafts through a stormy summer night. When the sky cracks open and the sparks glow bright. No, this was but the gentle, soothing smell of a human-made flame. And here we are on our adventure. Like I said, it looked really neat, and I already played 18 minutes of it, and it was a lot of fun. Yep, definitely been here before. I recognize that bush and those branches. You always recognize at least one bush. I think we should be 40 paces north of the trail. The big oak should be just around the corner. You're a big oak. Wait, that rock wasn't there last time. We are lost forever. I'm not sure about this. Maybe we should go back. That rock is definitely new. Yeah, that rock is definitely new. Don't be silly. I know exactly where we are. We'll just turn the corner and see that big calming oak tree. Unlike the tiny, catastrophizing ball of feathers we see now. You can't even recognize your own stupid tail. That's fair. <laughs> just a little bit of comedy. I mean, like I said, it looks fun. I think you guys are really going to enjoy this one. I just got to do the tutorial in the right order. Um, what's with a big mossy boulder with all the windows and smoke? It's not a boulder, you doof. That's a big stinking cabin. And smoke from a cabin means people. People? People like human people? I think you're right, Hank. We should probably go back. No, 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 no. There hasn't been a person in this valley in like a billion years. Nope. Now it's interesting. We better investigate. Hank? Now wait just a minute. Okay, now we have our tutorial. Bottom left is the to-do um, the to list. So it's our log. It says go inside the mossy cabin and see if you find anything. Our movement tutorial is move with wasp. You can move in and out with a wasp, wasp with a mouse wheel. E to interact, F5 to quick save, F9 to quick load, and your quest log is L. Up on the top right, you have the day, which is day 1, 10.37 a.m. It is 32.7 degrees Celsius and sunny. Hopefully in the actual, like, game release, they uh, have the ability and options to change it to Fahrenheit, because I don't know Celsius. I don't know. Is that hot? Is that cold? I have no idea. Let's talk to Will. I've got a bad feeling about this. Let's talk to Annie. I'm sure that oak is around here somewhere. Let's go investigate the house. Yeah, when I played it, recording it earlier, like five minutes ago, I went down to the south and cleaned out everything down there, but really it wants us to start by going right here, you know, the building it showed us to begin with. Silly me. And we're going to uh, take this apple out of this chest. Uh-oh. Here she comes. 
Hi. Oh, who's there? Why, what an unexpected visit. My, you're a big fellow, aren't you? You don't seem very frightening. That's all right. You're not the first critter to wander in my little home. Don't be afraid. Um, I'm sorry I didn't mean to break in. Brr. That's quite all right, dear. You didn't bother me at all. I'm Barbara. I've been the keeper of these woods ever since I could tell a Joppy Jeffrey from a blue shag. Do you know where you are? Uh, first off, what's a blue shag? Brr. Oh, of course you don't. You're not from around here. I would have known. Well, you're on the edge of Pinefall Resort. Or perhaps I should say what it used to be. Sad, sad story. But we're going to fix it up and make it beautiful again. Pinefall Resort used to be the bee's knees, the talk of the town. Right up till everything came crashing down. Now it's all ruins and garbage. We're going to fix it up, y'all. Oh, how I wish I could see it full of life again. You will. Granny, I don't remember your name already. Barbara, say you look like a robust gentleman. Gentle, uh, gentle creature? I don't suppose you'd be interested in more than looking for berries or rummaging under rocks, would you? I highly appreciate berries. Rah rah rah. <laughs> I don't know how to roar. Like, like, how do you excitedly roar? Uh, or rar. That is wonderful news. I always knew the forest would come in handy one day. With your help, I think we could convince, convince travelers to stop by our little corner of the forest again. That's beginning to sound suspicious, or at least I could do after breaking into your big mossy boulder. Roar, roar. First things first. No one's going to want to sleep in this wreck. We need to clear out the eastern cabin of all the debris inside. It's a lot, but somebody's got to do it. Head straight south from here is the first building you'll see. You can't miss it. Make sure you get everything upstairs, too. We'll go on, then. Okay. Time to go. So we have another tutorial popped up. Looting and foraging. Find fall holds many types of loot, indoors and outdoors. Press E while well, next to the debris, plants, or other objects to loot them. Left shift and left mouse bu or button are to split a stack. Loot all button is included. And you can find all sorts of materials and ingredients through foraging and scavenging. So there's, there's a lot more to this game than I thought. I don't know how much is in the demo, but like I said, we're going to cover it as full as we can. I'm actually going to pick up a couple of these things because they're here, so I might as well. Uh, this is an ingredient. It is mint and it will sell for three gold. There's also a lot of trash we gotta pick up. But she said to go clean the cabin to the south of her. So let's get this cleaned up. We're gonna pick up the trash as we walk by. Walk on by. We get to create rooms and decorate and cook and a lot. A lot, a lot. There's crafting, resource management. We get to get, invite people in to stay at our bear and breakfast. I know this is not what she asked me to do, but I gotta pick up some of this trash outside. Y'all know me in it. It's already driving me crazy and it's making my eyes switch. There's so much trash. Go ahead and grab these strawberries or tomatoes. Tomatoes. We're gonna need them to cook anyway, I believe. There's more buildings over there we gotta clean up, but not right now. We're gonna stay with the tutorial and do what she tells us to do, which is not what she was told, telling us to do. So, uh, let's go do what she asked before it gets too dark. Okay, so you just tap E and he's gonna loot everything on his own. Like here we have five copper plates. Oh, and then we're gonna go right here and continue looting. We got some rubber slab, plastic boards, and glass plan panel. What do we got here? Some planks. The old couch, planks, cotton, and iron. Or nails. Uh, planks, cotton, and more nails. Old shopping cart. Some rubber and some copper plates. Some more planks. Got an old broken down TV here. Uh, so rubber slate, board, and glass. I'm trying to show you some of the items that we're picking up. That's the same thing. Help you understand what we're doing more often. This game is available for the free demo for the next fest for the whole week. I think we got six more days of it. I only have one more day to record before the grandbaby gets here, and then it's no recording for a couple weeks for me. So I'm trying to get everything pre recorded so you guys still have content going up two or three times a day every day while she's here. Uh, more planks. But my son gets back from his deployment next month, so it's not too bad. Planks and cotton and nails, oh my. 
more planks. I'm excited to get into like the building and the designing. That's going to be a lot of fun. More boards. And there's a lot of buildings that we have to like clean up and such. So I know I saw three of them when I was recording it earlier. I don't know if there's more or not. I can't believe how I derped up the tutorial so badly. It clearly showed me where to go, and I clearly was like, oh, let's go down here and start investigating this, and yeah. Mistakes were made. Got more of that. Got more of that. Anything else? Sometimes there's stuff you can't see along the windowsills. Oh, and when you get here, it's going to have, um... Uh... I think it was wall... Yeah, it's going to be like this when you get in here. But all you gotta do is click on the wall of visibility and it will take it down for you. Which is pretty handy. It'll take the roof off so you can actually see what you're working with. Okay, nothing there. I think we got everything. I'm just gonna kind of walk along the side, walk on by, and make sure. Alright, let's go back up to... Oh, see, now it's all scratched off. Yeah, okay, so that is what I did wrong. I didn't go here first. Got it. Six garbage... I have to pick up all this garbage outside too. There's a lot of it. Let's see, what is this? Some more mint. A can. Uh, some herbs. Okay, let's go see Granny. All done. Did you clear out all the garbage in the eastern cabin? Yes, I'll clear. Relatively certain barren. Oh, sorry. Wonderful! I haven't seen it that clean in years. Let's see about getting it fixed up. Now that's done, I'll just need a bit of help to fix the place up. I'll need some of the things you found, though, through the rubble. If you don't have enough, try going through the other buildings. When you're done, go south near go southwest near the river and grab me some stone bricks. Go up the stream if you don't find enough. So southwest near the river, she needs stone bricks. But make sure you avoid that weasley little raccoon next to the ruins. I love raccoons. I always trouble that one. Raccoons are not trouble. Raccoons are amazing and perfection, and I love them. They are my favorite pet in the entire world. Don't talk trash about raccoons, or I'm not going to help you. Okay, so southwest, huh? So this is southwest-ish. Got to find the river. These are some more buildings that we can clear out, but I'm trying to stay on task with uh, what she's asking us to do, so I don't derp it up again. We've already got the plywood planks, the copper plates, and the iron bars. Oh, there's some shrooms. I haven't seen those before. Oh, let's see. It's an ingredient, of course. Let's loot that. What is this? It's different. Uh, oh, that's more shrooms. It just looks different. Lots of different things. It's pretty cool. Corn? Corn. Okay, she said to go up the stream, so I'm going to loot all this corn, because we're probably going to need it to cook up anyway. I mean, we need a bear. In order to have a good bear and breakfast, we gotta have foods. I don't see any stone bricks here. Oh, hello. Ipswich. Oh, hello. I haven't seen you here before. I'm not surprised. Excuse me? Tell me, child, do you reckon with the wild? Do you flirt with the bazaar? Beck in the Uncharted. I think I need a beck in a dictionary. I've been known to occasionally look far, far away in the distance. I think I need a beck in a dictionary. No, I didn't think so. You don't look the part. You've never set foot in a shadow darker than your mother's. If you think these woods are young, you're greener than the crudest sapling. There is nothing to fear but those who fear nothing. Ugh, fine. Just look at my little card if you want to buy something. But no garbage. I'm not falling for that garbage squirrel's trick again. Uh, okay. I don't have any money. Um, no, no, no. I was trying to look in your car. Oh, come on. Hold on, we gotta get through this again. Skippy skip. Okay, let's go this way to where we don't... Okay, so we can buy eggs, butter... Bread, cheese, milk, and sugar, and some wood. Oh, that's pretty neat. And we can sell them some stuff, too. I don't... We have 100 garbage, or 100 valuable. But we have no monies. And then we got blueprints here, too. Or crafting recipes. Bathroom mirror, bathroom toilet. Ooh! So can I sell you... 
I don't know how to sell things. Right click. Uh, can I sell you this? No room in that container. I don't know how to sell things. Maybe he doesn't buy things. Um, not really sure how that works. We'll figure it out as we go. Right now we're still looking for those stone bricks. We went all the way up the river and I haven't seen them yet. Just saw corn. This looks like it could be stone brick, but it's not. If I can grab some more corn up. Oh, stone bricks. What are you? I can't find you nowhere. But I'm finding lots of corn, so at least we're gonna have noms. I know it's not what we're supposed to be doing. Okay, let's get this trash. Nothing there. Oh, there we go, right there. Stone bricks. Ah, uh, there's three there. Let me go ahead and grab this trash, too. See more stone bricks right here. We need ten, so there's three more. Oh, look at this place. It's such a mess. Who would leave it in this condition? Freaking millennials, that's who. I can say that because I have two millennials that are my kids. Oh, there's one more. And there's some slabs. Some flowers. Chamomile. Oh, we can make some tea. Nice. Go ahead and grab that up. See what I mean, though? It's just like a really chill, relaxing kind of... It's, it's fun. I'm liking it. I might make this episode a little bit longer than a normal one, because I'm enjoying it. Or I might split it into the two like I normally do. We'll see. We'll see. Let's pick up all this garbage. I can't just let the garbage stand Go ahead and get whatever we can for bricks since uh I don't want to have to come all the way back here super quickly. We have a decent size inventory, so I'm happy with that. I mean we have a really good size inventory. Let me take that back. Okay, let's start heading home. We'll just pick up the trash we see, whatever little bits and bops are on the way. I'd like to have a good amount of stuff so that once we get home and start getting stuff fixed up, we're ready to go. Oh, what is all this over here? Oh, kitty! Oh, no, it's a raccoon! Hello! Hello! Hey, you big fella! I see you're dealing with old green hat over there. I'm not dealing with anyone. Oh, do you know her? Yeah, she isn't exactly new to the scene. I might have something that could be of interest. Hmm? Just check my dumpster. But don't even think about getting wise on me. If you want any of the trash in there, you need to get me some, um, valuables. You can find them all over the place. And I hear the smelly ones leave them all over, too. Now scram, I've got an image to maintain here. <gasps> we get to play with a raccoon who's a trader, Not like a bad trader, so he likes valuables, and we have 224 valuables. The trash we're picking up is valuables. So this floor lamp is only three valuables. Medium rug is two. Oh, this is cheap. Let's get... A coffee table. Uh, let's get some artwork. Uh, that's like cheese. Some end shells, maybe. We have tons of valuables, so a wood shelf, a critter totem, no, a flower vase. Yeah, that'll be nice. We'll be able to decorate our house up from the beginning or our bare and breakfast. We'll get some candles, lots of inventory room. I like that rug, too. We still have loads. Man, this is where we need to go. Uh, pick up all that trash. Yeah, that moose painting. Or that moose carving. We'll do the happy fish. We'll do the potted plant. Still got tons of money. Or valuables. That rustic table. Possum clock. Rocking sheep. Yeah, let's grab that. Let's see. Let's grab that simple rug. Man, so many things. We're gonna have all the decorations. Oh, yeah, we need to welcome some. That's, that's for sure. Oh, a bucket of paint. Let's go ahead and grab that. Uh, clothing, camo painted invisible pants. I don't know that we need that. Toolbox, yep, that looks good. Terrarium, sure, why not? 
Uh, let's get the small plant. We still have over 150. Man, he sells stuff for cheap. You are my kind of dude, my large table leg. Alright. That's all we have space for. Thank you, Took. I think that was his name. Let's get back to... Oh, can I clean up any of this? I would be happy if I could. No? Okay, fine. Fair enough. Fair enough. Let's get back to Granny. That's another place we gotta clean out, but not right now. We're letting the tutorial guide us. Okay, so I didn't realize when I was picking up all this trash that these are valuables that we can sell to... Is it Took? I don't remember if that's his name or not. So that's quite handy instead of having to worry about money. We can do most of this. I mean, we're still gonna need those blueprints and such. Oh, that's not where I wanted to go. I'm gonna go behind here. But this will help with furniture. Grab that. And I think we're almost there. Yeah, here we go. I didn't get lost. Go us. You got everything. Yep, caught them all. Amazing how much you can carry with just two paws. Do you have pockets on that thing? You don't want to know. You, you really don't. It would be a nightmare that would scar you for a life. And no, it wasn't a prison pocket either. Now this I haven't seen. We didn't get this far when I recorded it last time. So I am excited. Let's do this. I agree. 100% agree, agree. Already looks better. Wow. That wasn't as easy as I thought. That you didn't think the old woman had a dinner. Go ahead, check it out. And come back so we can have a little chat. Okay, so the Eastern Cavern. Congrats on repairing the Eastern Cabin. This is the only cabin available in this demo to build stuff in. Aww. The Western and Southern Cabins will be unlocked later in the full game. I mean, I understand that. So, let's check it out. So, build. Not so soon. Please try again later. Aww. Okay, I checked it out. So, what do you think? Uh, that was honestly kind of impressive. Oh, shucks. You're not going to make me blush. That knocked the wind out of me, though. I better go have a little rest. Oh, oh, before I go, I've got one more thing for you. What you got? I like surprises. Where are you going? I can't move my character. Don't leave me! Oh, okay. I'm scared of the dark. Why do you look a little green? This little table will help you make things. Ooh, but of course it's only a tool. You're gonna need to learn how to craft stuff yourself. Here, I'll help you get started. Come back to me after you've crafted one. You've unlocked a new crafting recipe for a bed. If you need materials, there's plenty of old debris lying around in the torn down buildings. Oh, neato. Interact with the crafting table to open the crafting menu. There are plenty of blueprints around the pine pole to find and learn. You'll need them to craft stuff. Once you've learned something, make sure you have the necessary materials and then craft away. Oh, neat. Okay. Oh, there's the crafting bench right there. That's where she was going. So, um, bed. One plank. Or one plywood plank and one cotton. Let's go ahead and craft that. Uh, I think I'm out of space. I am. Okay, let's place some of these things down. Uh, and let's get out of there. wonder if I can build walls. Can I build walls? Oh, no. Um, so, and we need to go to our backpack. And do I just like... How do I place this? Hmm. What should we do? The scene. What? Should, what? How do I place this stuff? Do I have to like put it? Hmm. Your cabin. Room list, stay request, reviews, rooms, no available rooms to display, build more bedrooms. I'm trying, and I don't actually know how. So, build. Also, okay. That doesn't work. 
Wall visibility, your cabin options, inventory. Hmm. Craft your first bed. That's been done. Did we not have inventory space for it, maybe? No, it says we did it. Hold on. Hold on. Oh, wait, I think I need to go back and talk to her. Let's, let's go look. Did you craft a bed yet? Yep, nails and all. Hey, that's not half bad for someone who basically wears oven mitts all the time. Now let's put that to good use. So we need to... Can we build now? Can we, can we? No! Okay, so can I place you now? I have no idea how to place this, y'all. Uh, except... I am failing epically. Let's talk to her again. There's nothing on my to-do list. I don't think I've asked what your name is. How very rude of me. Hank. My name is Hank. Such a beautiful name. I have a hard time remembering these things, of course, so I'll just call you Cubby. So that's alright. Uh, yeah. What? Wonderful. Well, Cubby, if we want people to come over and stay with us, they're going to need a place to sleep. Here's a little bit of money. But don't spend it all before we can make some more. We'll need to build things. Go in that cabin and build me a functional bedroom. Oh yay, now build mode's open. Thank you. Press B to enter build mode. A free camera mode that allows you to build things. Choose whether or not you would like to build rooms or place objects from your inventory. To build a room, select it from the list. Draw the footprint of the room and hit, the hit, and hit then hit next. Make sure you meet the minimum required size. Ah, place a doorway for your room and hit done. Uh, click on furniture, click, oh my goodness, words are hard now. Click and place furniture objects from your inventory into the room, only in build mode. Uh, most rooms demand a mandatory object before they can be functional. You can pause building a room if you don't have the mandatory object and return to place it. Click a room to edit its contents or delete it altogether. Rooms are usually pretty particular about which objects you can place in them. Decorations, objects have no restrictions. You can place them wherever. Oh, I'm excited. B. So we want to... Hallway. No, how do I... I want a bedroom. How do I make a bedroom? Uh, floor one. Ah, there we go. We want... Comfort, water, food, utility, and special... Comfort, single bedroom. There we go. Let's put you... That? Wait, no, no, I want floor two, don't I? That's going to be where we eat and such down there. So let's go floor two. Uh, 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 uh. No, 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 no. Stop. B. Please put the... Take the roof off. I can't see what I'm doing. How do I cancel? Cancel, cancel, cancel. Let me just dirt this up completely. Okay, now let's go build. And I want the second floor. Oh. Okay, so floor one is there. Ground floor is... Okay, so it's actually... Never mind. I get it now. She can be taught, folks. So we need comfort, single bedroom. We're going to put that right over here. So we can put another one right beside it. Uh, two by three is the size. Place a door. Wait, what is that? Oh, it's an actual like full wall. Oh, okay. Uh, let's do yeah. We'll do a door there, and then we'll do another one on this side and put a door here. Okay, that's done. Place furniture. So let's put the bed. Right there, and we're going to give them some a little dresser. Let's put some art on the wall. Uh-huh, uh-huh, and let's put some candlesticks up on the dresser. Uh, no, that's too big for in there. Or it's not the right flower vase. Yeah, there we go. So this bedroom is giving us plus five on comfort and plus seven for all the extra things we're putting in. Um, what else do we want to put in there? Do we have a chair? I mean, we have a table light. Uh, we could do a moose carving. 
kind of too big for there, though, isn't it? Oh, I could probably fit it here. Yeah, we could fit it right there. Perfect. And, oh, yeah, let's put a carpet in. Like right in front of the... But you want to step off the bed onto something warm. You don't want to step onto a cold ground. So let's put you there. And we can put a rocking sheep in here. So if they have a kid, they have a little toy. Fantastic. Okay, furniture is placed. And then let's go ahead and build... Where does water? Small public bathroom. And we're going to put you... Probably over here. Three by three is the minimum. So one, two, three. Oh, 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 no, no. Cancel. Cancel. Mistakes were made. Small public bathroom. Right here. Perfect. Blueprint has been drawn. Walls are up. Door is going to go right here. And we need a, oh, we need sinks, toilets, and showers, which we don't have any of those. So for now, that's just going to sit like that. Um, let's go ahead and say we're going to wait on that. Let's go back into build. And we need food. That's going to be on the ground floor. So let's do a dining room. Three by three. We're going to put the kitchen, I think, back here. No, put the kitchen like here. And we'll put a big dining hall back here. Yeah, that'll work. And let's go next. Door is going to go... No, I think I want the door over here. There we go. And we need serving tables, dining tables, and chairs, which we don't have any of. But, you know, we've got that mapped out. Let's go ahead and do uh, food, kitchen. Oh, I'm spending all my money on this before I even get the stuff. And we're going to go there. Place the door right about there. And we need griddles, cookers, and cutting boards. Which we will get to that. Let's also uh, let's see. Special. Oh, that's 300. We're going to wait on that. Bear and breakfast, y'all. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and share. And as always, before I go, remember when gaming, have fun, play hard, but in real life, be the change you wish to see in the world. It's coming along nicely. We've got one bedroom going up here, actually. We can go get our bathroom here, which we got to get finished, which we will do in an upcoming episode. Later, y'all. Oh, the kitchen is in the wrong spot. The kitchen is straight through the front door. I forgot all about that. Uh, can we delete a room? Uh, delete. Absolutely. Totally wrong there. I wonder if we get our money back. How much money do we even have? Oh, 1,040 and 197 valuable still. Oh, okay. Fair enough. Later, y'all. So.